Here we are leaving Ashland, Oregon. Our first electric journey. We're going for one month. Charging out the sun when we can and charging stations when we need to. reached Grants Pass. Actually been here about an hour and we're picking up our, our first charge of the journey. We tried an Eaton power station, level two, over by the hospital and didn't have any luck. It uh, threw a fault and we couldn't figure out why. It's the second time we've had trouble with the Eaton charging stations. So we're going to have to figure that out. Here we used an AeroVironment which we also use in Ashland. I knew that one worked so we opted for that. The great part about it is we did 44 miles and we only used 40 amp hours. So I have about 80 amp hours that I can use. So that, that puts us, of course it's not a linear relationship, it starts to drop off towards the end of charge, but it's looking like 60, 70 miles of range at the, uh, at the rate I'm going, albeit quite slow, I've been doing probably an average of 35 miles an hour. Uh, but hey, we're camping and this is, this is the idea here, we're trying to slow down and go farther. And we are. So in about five minutes here, we're going to be done charging. My feet are burning. So I'm going to step back. Um, so we were able to pick up a charge in an hour because we didn't use that much. So we're just about ready to go. Um, we're headed to O'Brien, 36 mile stint. And we're going to pick up our speed a little bit. We'll be going down the 199, so I don't want to back up traffic too bad there. And uh, so I'm going to see if I can pick up my speed. That's going to reduce my range, but at, at uh, 60 miles going slow, I should be able to go, you know, 45, 50 at least and, uh, and get to O'Brien with still not um, discharging my batteries too much. So the solar is putting out about 6 amps right now, so it's adding to what this charging station is putting in. I should be seeing about 8 amps though, so I have to do a little more maximization there um, with the DC-DC converters on each panel. So, we're off to O'Brien. Today we made it to O'Brien, Oregon, a little campground here where we charged up with a NEMA charger and now we're just sitting by the fire more the milk. eating s'mores of milk. Got the pop-up, got our bed set up, had some hot dogs. So interestingly enough we did 44 miles from Ashland to Grants Pass, we used 40 amp hours, which is half of my charge, 80 amp hour total. Which means that at that pace, this thing could probably do 75 miles, which is wonderful. However, from Grants Pass to O'Brien, where we are tonight, we had to take the 199. We were forced to go a lot faster, or, or back up tra traffic for a ways, and and it was it was really interesting to see just how um, how range is reduced with with speed and and basically how many amps you pull out of your bank. We did 36 miles, give or take, and I used 70 amp hours, which means I may I would have only gotten probably a total of 40, maybe 45 at that speed, which is averaging about 45, 50, right in there. But we made it, and although it was slightly stressful, and we're all really tired, um, I want to go to bed. Yeah, we all want to go to bed. But first, we are going to cut some wood because we can. We've got a still electric chainsaw. Wait, no, Husqvarna electric chainsaw. Yeah. It's been a while since we've used this. So. It's 
running off of the inverter and the batteries from the van. 